We have a number of local races for city council, school board and Newport News mayor. That's where we find 10 on your sides, Brett Hall. So Brett, we have an apparent winner in this race. Yes, uh, just uh, about a 30 minutes ago, Philip Jones declared victory to be the next mayor of Newport News with 40% of the vote unofficial. We have 45 out of the 47 precincts in and we're with the uh, declared mayor elect right now. Congratulations, Philip. Uh, how you feeling? Thanks, Brett. I'm, I'm really excited. Um, we started this campaign months ago and it feels surreal that we're here now. I want to give a special shout out to my team. They are the heart and soul of this campaign and I could not have done it without them. What was the feeling when you saw, the, saw that you probably had this in, in the bag? It was humbling. Um, so many voters put their, their trust and their confidence in me, and I'm going to work every single day to ensure that we keep that. I know, uh, you know this is going to be, you're going to probably start moving off, but it, it struck me as you had the endorsement of the late uh, Joe Frank, and uh, that must have been uh, kind of a humbling experience as well, knowing his recent passing. I would say there, there's been so many bridge builders that have laid a strong foundation, including Mayor Frank, uh, including Mayor Price, uh, and I'm just working or looking forward to building off of that foundation and moving forward uh, the city boldly into the future. All right, well, thank you very much. We're going to talk with you again in a few minutes over on Fox 43, get some more about his plans coming up. For now, in Newport News, Brett Hall, 10 on your side.